Hello chess friends, hope you're doing well, I've got some chess secrets to share that can boost your elo, to succeed in chess, practice and patience are key, and of course you've got to love the game, don't be disheartened by losses, I've brought you an extraordinary game of Magnus where he held on even when he was losing, it's going to be an epic and the best chess video of your life, let's dive in, Mango started the game with d4, knight f6 knight c3, black can play d6, let me show you the variation. E4 G6 is called Pirate Defense, it's a very defensive opening which you can play against every opponent including Dinosaur in Chess.com. Queen D2 makes a battery to eliminate the bishop, best move is to play E5 or C5 for black but if he plays Rook E8 he will fell for this trap, we wouldn't play E5 to trap the knight, we have something special technique to defeat black, E5 take take knight H5 G4 and the knight have only one square left to go, g7 castle then play bishop to c4 to target the wood door. Knight is coming to burn the door, best move for black is to bring out his queen but if he plays e6 to block the diagonal he will be dead lost, knight e5, using these outposts to become 5 star army officer, queen here bishop g5, queen f8 then sacrifice your queen to checkmate black smoothly. If someone wants to be with you, nothing will stop them from doing so, because love doesn't create any excuses, back to the game, we have d5, you and me also love chess which is why we will play chess forever, there is no other game like chess unless it involves intellectual moves, Magnus played g4 to push his army, he learned from my recent video where I talk about a new chess opening which was invented by Alpha, although that move is very easy to understand but you know, humans know everything. Still they act like fool, knight e4 is not good because I can simply capture it, you will face double d pawn problem and you can't save the e4 pawn at all. So here we have knight d7, when things don't go as your desires, life and chess become boring, and most of the time, nothing unfolds according to your expectations, h5 to push the h pawn, therefore Magnus can re-rotate his knight accordingly, h6 g6, if you capture the pawn, bishop d3 will attack it, so knight e7. Knight jumps into e5 to add pressure, best move for black is to play g5, slapping the mosquito, but if you dare to play queen b6 to play a healthy move, I will capture it, take take queen takes pawn, take rook d8, queen g4 attacking to the pawn, so the king can't run, so after 3 moves we will try to unfold the a file with a4, because the king is very insecure, it's like being in a jungle where there's a group of lions in front of you and a crocodile river behind, hard to escape, queen d6 queen d4. The queen is under attack so if you play queen c5 you will be dead, can you make a brilliant move for white? I am pretty sure you can't, bishop to b5 check, first of all the king move because c5 will kick out. The king from his queen's safety, that's the problem so if he dare to capture the bishop, check king b6, knight a4 check king backs check, here, check king b7 queen a7, happy checkmate and do you know a fact. The happier we are, the less sleep we require, back to the game, black played f5, if you are having trouble playing your best moves and end up making blunders, you should exercise because it increases your intelligence, bishop g3 knight f4 is the best move to play but Magnus captured the c-pawn which is an inaccuracy, before bishop b6, best move for white is to play bishop g2 or a4, but Magnus played a mistake move knight d4, it's a mistake move because it doesn't have any idea to attack black. The knight is jobless there like an uneducated man, the knight gives an opportunity to black to play e5, how can Magnus deal with it, knight e2 was the best move but he captured the b5 pawn, although you can't capture the knight, let me show you the variation, queen takes d5 king slides, takes to attack this innocent, if rook b8 happen then bishop h4 will trap the queen. A study found that living in sight of water can make you calmer, happier and more creative, so in this position you might think of playing bishop c8, queen d5 and still, white have good attacking chances. So back to our current variation, we have c4, black should have gone for the knight, you don't have to fear for this, because you are invincible, queen d6 take take bishop g2 queen check, king e2 f4, white is in great trouble, best advice for white is to play queen c1, do a queen exchange and give up the bishop, but if you dare to save the bishop then after takes queen takes queen b2 check king f1 queen takes check, knight e1 pawn captured and that's it, white is completely losing. 
the king is exposed and everything will be over for white and friends if you are enjoying my content then please like and subscribe to my channel, it's mandatory, back to the position, he played d4, a little mistake move, c5 takes and if you dare to capture the knight, then after bishop check, knight blocks takes takes d takes e3 pawn captured, rook d8 and that's it, you are gonna lose your material, and the king is in middle of the board. People who try to keep everyone happy often end up feeling the loneliest so back to the position Magnus played rook c1, he could play knight c6 to move back the bishop path, anyway it takes b5 bishop takes pawn, here black can capture the pawn which is the best move, takes knight before castle, takes takes takes, e2 is coming to burn your position, so king h8 and after a few moves, black will play f4, black is going to make pass pawn, and he have crazy bishops, white is just losing the game. I am telling you for an another time, if you haven't subscribed to my channel then just subscribe, don't become like black, bishop a6, takes takes b5, black could play knight c5 but he played f4, although black is winning the game, but you know what this is a blitz game. World champion Magnus Carlsen is the best player in the world not just because he has the highest rating but also because of his speed, when you're losing in a blitz or bullet chess game, it's essential to play fast and make correct moves. In a blitz game between Artem and Magnus on title Tuesday, Artem took too much time, thinking he was playing against the highest rated player. Despite having a winning position, Artem lost on time. Magnus secured the win due to black running out of time, which is quite remarkable, even if you're ahead in material against Magnus, playing quickly is crucial. Wish you all the best. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. Bye bye, take care, and see you soon.